For a few years, my family lived in a home on Greenfield Street, right between the Home Ec House and Hulk House, where, Will, where Brown Hall now resides. Never in my wildest dreams, as I gazed at Willard Hall, would I have imagined the spectacular complex fitting so seamlessly into the campus landscape. Thanks to the vision of Heidelberg's leadership, President Rob Huntington and your senior leadership team, the Board of Trustees, and those of you who gave gifts, this has become a reality. My only regret is that my parents and brother could not partake in this wonderful activity that will, on all the activities that will continue to enhance this special place. My, how times have changed, and I must say for the better. When my family moved to Tiffin in 1946, my mother washed football uniforms. <laughs> my father would pick up the football films after church on Sunday and then set up the projector in our dining room. We watched films for hours, and apparently I became quite proficient in watching the offensive and defensive line. <laughs> so I got assignments to locate who blocked whom. That's how I learned to watch football. It was a Sunday tradition for many years. I would like to introduce members of Ted and my family who have joined us in this celebration. Our son Paul, his wife Denise, and sons Christian and Vincent. Christian, a babe in arms, was also at South Bend when my father was inducted into the National Football Hall of Fame. Our younger son Brian, which I am not sure Oh, there he is. <laughs> he did make it. And his son, Grant. David's son, Eric, and his wife, Mary, and daughter, Kitty. And David's son, Scott, and Jill. I have often wondered and thought, as this dedication drew closer, what my father would feel as he strolled this facility. I know he would be thrilled for the students imagining all the possibilities these entities hold. He would enjoy alumni and community gatherings, but most of all, he would be so proud of all his players, alumni, and friends who chose to keep Heidelberg in their hearts as he always kept you in his. Thank you for this tremendous tribute to my father. This is a day the Herneman family will always remember. Now, all we need to do is chalk up a victory over Muskegon. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.